Well, think a minute about how hard it is to monitor your own social media, much less your child's. Now multiply that by hundreds or thousands, and you have a little insight into the monumental challenge school districts face uh, in weeding out threats to school safety online. KXAN Steffi Lee shows us some tools that districts in Texas are getting to root out and prevent potential violence. It's a challenge for us to have to keep up with that and to see what those new trends are. Huddo ISD Police Chief William Edwards knows students are smart and tech savvy. All the way from you know things that we wouldn't have thought of 10 years ago, like using a Google Doc on a shared server is a means of communication because it's a dynamic document that uh, individuals can get on and basically type back and forth. These law enforcement officials, school safety directors, and IT experts are getting more training to stay on top of social media trends. So that they can take those lessons and do a better job and be more informed in their approach to intervene early and prevent what's so preventable. Some Texas schools are already monitoring what students post online, but Chief Edwards says it can be hard to keep up. When something comes about on social media, a lot of times it has a tendency to carry out uh, quicker than what the investigation can uh, can you know keep up with. Platforms like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat all have guidelines for when law enforcement officers make emergency requests, which take time, as do device search warrants. We're seeing the social media platforms actually starting to evolve as well. The Texas School Safety Center has experts providing specific training to cut through red tape, how to verify photos, investigate alarming words, and ways to preserve potential evidence in a timely manner. And we need with our young people today, they have a cell phone, so they need to know if they see something online, um, they see something on Snapchat or Instagram, how do they use a different device to take a screenshot of that or to video it and to get that to people that can look into it. Steffi Lee, KXAN News. Later this month, it's expected the U.S. Secret Service National Threat Assessment Center will release a report studying school shootings and past school shooters. The center is the agency that developed the threat assessment model, which provides guidance on how to identify students of concern and assess risk of violence.